that we need to intervene and prevent new wounds developing on the lower leg. So wounds such as skin tears and stopping them from progressing to an ulcer, resulting in poor patient outcomes. We do talk a lot about prevention um, in, across the NHS, but particularly in primary care. And we talk about it being a key driver, yet I question if this is the case in wound care. There is a need to make a change in what we're doing to make it more effective. So thinking about how do we as GPNs prevent new wounds changing or developing um, today from, sorry, how do we prevent new wounds on the leg today from becoming the leg ulcers of tomorrow? Venous disease is a long-term condition, but is not often viewed or treated as such in terms of the lower limb. General practice nurses have immense value in prevention, and we do that every day in our jobs with lots of chronic diseases and make every contact count. And I like this last point on the slide, that I like analogies to practice nursing, and, and I, I think of it as malcompression as being the vaccine against venous leg ulcers. Uh, I think that's a good way to remember it.